Do you care if people believe you are Jesus or not? <laughs> no, not at all. And as I said earlier, it does not matter if a person believes I am Jesus or not. What I would love for them to do is to listen to the teachings and to develop their own relationship with God to experiment with the teachings, basically. I do not feel they need to have a relationship with me in order to do that. I do not feel they need to believe that I am Jesus in order to do that. There is no necessity on any person who knows me to automatically accept that I am Jesus. Very few of the people who actually know me do accept that I am Jesus at this point in time. Now in the future, as time goes on and I get more and clo closer and closer to one with God, hopefully, once, uh, and once I become at one with God, maybe it will be a lot easier for some of those people to believe that I am Jesus. However, it is not necessary for them, for their future, for their relationship with God, for their own personal happiness or any of those things to believe that I am Jesus. It is not necessary for them to believe that I am Jesus in order to have a relationship of a kind with me. Of course, if a person does not believe I'm Jesus, then they don't accept who I am. And it's very difficult for me to have an open relationship with a person who does not accept me as I am. So it will affect their relationship with me, whether they believe I'm Jesus or not, but it definitely will not accept their affect their relationship with God or with or their own happiness or their own partner or their own families or their own friends as to whether they believe I'm Jesus or not. Of course, some people believe that others are crazy if they believe I'm Jesus, but that's, but that's their interpretation and their emotions, and I don't have any bearing on those particular matters. I, I have no control over those particular matters. But I feel that uh, most people don't accept that I'm Jesus, and I'm still happy to discuss more truth with them while they're open to receiving it. However, in, when it comes to having a personal relationship with me, it's going to be very difficult for a person to eventually have a personal relationship with me and at the same time not believe that I'm Jesus because in the end I act like I'm Jesus and I you know, respond to the name and, and I, I, I'm completely myself with, with all people and sooner or later people will find it difficult to either not accept me as Jesus or they'll probably find that they don't want to spend any time with me. So in terms of having a personal relationship with me, most people will probably, at some point, if they wish to have a personal relationship, have to come to accept that I am Jesus at some point through some emotional process um, that they might need to go through. And However, to have a relationship with God, they don't need to know me at all. They don't need to accept me at all. They don't need to do any of those things. Once I become at one with God, it will be a little different because once a person is at one with God, God's love is working through that individual. And if you deny a person who's become one with God, then in a lot of ways you are also going to be denying God as well. And that, uh, because God is working through the individual. Now, once we do that, it's going to be very difficult to maintain a relationship with God as well. So you can grow in your relationship to a certain point without accepting that I am Jesus. But at some point in the future, you'll have to resolve the truth of it sooner or later. <laughs> and my suggestion is work through the emotional reasons why it's difficult to resolve. If you don't want to work through those reasons, then don't. And, you know, have, hold on to your current belief systems, that's fine. But at least listen to the divine truth that we're presenting because you'll find there's many very interesting things that will help you in your own relationship with God. They might not help you in your relationship with me, but they'll definitely help you in your relationship with God.